Hello and welcome back to my videos. In this video we will speak about the Docker and the Docker registry and how you can secure it with basic authenticator. It's not the best way, but it's it's okay. And if you're using for development purpose, it will protect you against the most of it. So let's begin to create our, our composer file. I just save it here. And then we need to type the service, the version, sorry, and we use 3.7. And then we need the service, basic authenticator is the service name. And we need to build based on authenticator folder. And the ports is still port 5000. If you have followed the previous videos I've built, then you know port 5000 is the registry port but you can of course change this port if you want and then we want to say the authenticator should be password it's the way apache uh, used the uh, basic authenticator and then we need the authenticator ht password no yes sorry and we need the realm and basic realm and the path of this file should be authenticator Here it is. And now we can create a new folder called Authenticator. And inside this, we want the Docker file. And here we want to create the Docker file. So, what we want here is the whoops from registry run encoder. We need to create the Authenticator folder. And then we want to ask for the password. BNP. You can use the manual to to see what the, what is mean, but it's just mean we need a username and password, and we pull it to this file. And that's it. That's going for the terminal and spin it up. And you can see it's downloaded from the registry. I have cleaned up all my images. And now it should be running. Yes, it's running. So let's go in for the browser. And here we're going for local host, 5000. And you can see here's no any kind of, um, of uh, protection. But if I'm going down here to version 2 in the catalog, you can see authentication is up here. But if I'm cancel it, we don't have access to it, so let's reload again and say admin admin, and then we are inside here. So let's going back for the terminal and uh, test about how we can push uh, an image to it. So first, I need to pull Docker pull and Unix. That's fine, and then we need to say Docker login. And we need to log into the local host 5000 and we use the admin admin and then we should of course we need to say docker check uh, nginx local host 5000 nginx then docker push local host and then it should be here if I'm going back for the browser a last time and reload we have it here so that's how we can put in the basic uh, authentication and be sure not everybody is uh, pushing to your uh, registry server so that's uh, very nice and of course it's not very unsecure but I would recommend to use some kind of token or something like that but it's very good for basic using and 
yeah that's all for now uh, I hope you want to subscribe my channel in the right corner below if you don't know that and if you have any questions please make them in the comments fields below I'll try to answer them as fast as possible and of course I'll be very happy if you add it to your playlist and hit the like button and as always you can find this code on my github profile the link is down is below in the description and then you can follow me on github or you can do whatever you want thank you so much and see you next time bye bye